TFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN, 12 noon Eastern time on Wednesday, middle of the trading day. And we got markets oscillating around positive and negative prices. Right now, you're looking at an S&P positive by 11 points, trading at 34.06, trading higher within about the last hour, trading to an intraday low. That low made at just about 10.45, almost closer to 11 a.m. Eastern time, a low of 33.92. Since then, we're up about 15 points in the S&Ps, 34.06. Two hours from right now, we'll get a Fed announcement. Two and a half hours from right now, we'll get a Fed press conference. NASDAQ 100, negative by 56 points, 11,393. You get the Dow up 184 points, above 28,000, 28,092. Russell 2000 catching a bid up 1.3% on the session, up about 20 points at 15.55. Get the gold contract up $10 at 1975. Oil, how about oil? Above $40, up $1.73. You back it up to where we were early on Tuesday. You're up almost $3 from that price point of just above $37. Silver up eight pennies at $27.55. Notes and bonds, pretty muted action as we await a Fed decision and a Chairman Powell press conference. We got the 10 year up about one tick at 139.17. The 30 year up 11 ticks at 176.27. We'll check in on the VIX. As it's noon and we're backing off as we got a little bit of a pop in the markets, 2568 right now on that volatility index. In terms of what else we have happening, a big day of news, 8.30 a.m. We kick things off with retail sales. That number for August coming in at about 0.9%, excuse me, 0.6% from the prior month. They were looking for about 1%. You had a downward revision for the previous month to 0.9%. When you get into the core number, we're only talking about a decrease of 0.1%, also missing estimates. And that core number often considered a more reflective of underlying consumer demand as it excludes food services, car dealers, building material stores, and gasoline. All right, what else we got going on, folks? The Big Ten, they're going to be back with football. We got a couple stocks moving. You have Disney, the owner of ESPN, trading a bit higher on that. They got some of the games. Fox has some of the games there. We got home builder sentiment rising. You have Lennar up 3.6%. KB Homes, they're positive as well by about 4%. FedEx out with their earnings last night, trailing a bit, but still up about 5.4%. And Adobe. Quite a pullback on Adobe. Strong numbers. Spikes to 522 last night. Now trading at 483. Stay tuned, folks. We get a replay this hour. Basil's not doing his show, but live shows. Steve Rhodes, Dave White, Tom O'Brien, all.